Santa only has a few days left to hear this year's Christmas wish list, but as Julie Kreisen shows us, some youngsters are asking for a few unusual gifts this holiday. You close with money, huh? Santa Claus is busy at the Tippecanoe Mall hearing last minute Christmas wishes, but with the usual wish list. I want a Barbie nutcracker and Cinderella. There's also some not so tangible things kids are asking for. I'm hearing more children saying they're talking about either keep their families together or peace. Yeah, I had a uh, gentleman the other night come in and uh, he wanted to. Uh, have enough money to cover for his uh, father's gift. I had a uh, uh, little girl the other night say uh, she wanted to be able to wish her daddy a Merry Christmas. And when I asked where he was, she said up in heaven. Children are even hoping Santa can bring home their loved ones who are serving our country. I do have the uh, average fair, the families that have their uh, one or two of their parents overseas. So they're asking that they uh, be home for Christmas. Santa Claus is also busy responding to letters like these that children send in the mail. I'm thinking we're around 400 or so this year. Members of the local National Association of Letter Carriers collect children's wish lists and then send replies back from the North Pole. I just think they have a great um, joy in getting a letter from Santa and it, it just make the kids happy. Letter carrier Leslie Morgan says this year many children are asking for pets or even gifts for their pets. One person asked for a cat, a dog, a hamster, a guinea pig, a fish, and then they, the next page was, and I want cat food, dog food, hamster food. <laughs> and as a sign of the times, others are asking for presents for people other than themselves. One of the hardship letters we got, the, the lady really just wanted to get some clothing for her children. If, you can't, if Santa can't bring everything that they asked for to them, to give them to somebody else which I thought was really interesting this year. Maybe the kids are also kind of picking up on hard times. The letter carriers even received a letter from a teacher this year. She wished for every child to get a toy and to have enough food to eat every day. Morgan hopes Santa and the letter carriers can help deliver a brighter new year. Julie Kreisen, News Channel 18.